G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Zawoodle, and welcome back to The Forest, where I'm back playing one of my all-time favourite games in preparation for the sequel, Sons of the Forest, to come out in not too long now, actually. But I am back hanging out in my sweet treehouse that six-year-old me is very jealous of. It was a very successful first day, we dropped into the forest in a plane crash and apparently got away with it. Built ourselves some shelter and carried on. But today, I want to go and explore the coastline, which I think is just over there somewhere. Because there are some necessities. If I get out of the rain, actually, might be a good idea. There are some necessities in life that I need. I need to get some water, which means I have to go and murder some turtles. And <laughs> I'll have to just quench that guilt trip by drinking all the fluids out of its back. So that's my goal for today. But before I can go off and murder that small creature, I have to murder some other creatures like those bunny rabbits over there because I need a snack. Lizard, lizard, I need to eat you. Wait for it. Go. No, damn it. Swing down. Oh, would you please actually hit the bloody Gowana? It's right around your toesies. Okay, I'm starting to think. Oh, come on! That was definitely a slice off your tail! Get back here and slide your steak into me fire! Oh, that was brutal! I decapitated the thing! Oh, but you are like a ready-made sausage. Don't need to grind you up and slice you into anything because you come ready ground. I feel a bit bad about that. I put an axe to the back of its head. Oh, there's your first guilt trip for the day. <laughs> How are you going to deal with murdering some turtles? Oh, boy. But yeah, I'm starting to think that chasing things around and swinging axes at it isn't quite a great idea. I might need something better. I'll chuck that lizard on my fire. There we go. You're looking good. Burn some money like I'm Pablo freaking Escobar to keep it nice and sizzly. Does that mean that, like, do I get... Do I get extra nutrition by burning money to cook that thing? Is it enriched by the riches? I doubt it, but it's a nice thing to think about. Look at those bunny rabbits down there. Look at them frolicking about with their big bloody ears. I'm coming for you though, Flopsy. How do I make a bow? Well, I assume actually, by chucking all of those to make some rope. And you, you're close to, ooh, close to something. Craft, that's crafted bow. Hang on, what do I need for that? Rope? Cloth? Is that what it said? Hey, there we go. Okay, how do I make arrows then? <laughs> There's, ha, arrows are surely a thing. Small rocks? How do I how do I make arrows? Oh, there we go. Just feathers and sticks. I like this thing. I'm not sure if this was ever a thing before, but hovering over the gear gives you like all the options for you. So five arrows. I need some feathery boys. In you go. Craft you up. Uh, I'll take all of those and maybe even make some more. One, two. Gonna have to murder some more pheasants to get some more of that, but that's all right. Okay. Now, this was something I always struggled with before to uh, equip things to my backpack. It was like that, and then that. Had to, like, combine them and say that number three needs to be my bow. I don't know why they decided to do it that way, but that's just the way it works. Oh, you're cooked now, bunny rabbit. I'm coming for you. Right after I eat this <laughs> entire goanna... Nom. Nom. Head first, slide it in, get it down your gullet. Be very, very quiet. Damn it! We were hunting rabbits. I guess not anymore. Okay, I can cancel my arrow by right-clicking. That's good to know. Anything else around here that needs to come and stick to the eye like your freaking Harold in 1066? Oh, there's one. No, damn it, you quick bastard! I know your entire life is looking out for predators, but I don't look like the predators you're used to. Are those like... Oh, shit. Didn't mean to fall down the cliff. Are those ducks or swans or something? I mean, I need food and I need feathers and they seem to be having both of them. So... Oh, there is a cave here. Is there? No, it's just a waterfall. I remember there being caves and like cliff faces and stuff like that. So I thought I found one, but nah, it's fine. How the dick do I aim this thing? There. There. Not even close. Now I'm just wasting arrows. All right, geese, migrate off somewhere else. And if that's the way you want to be, can I use this? Anything in here for me? No. Can I at least drink the water? Also, no. Oh, there we go. I can drink the water. I was too busy just like enjoying the koi pond and looking at all the fishies down there. Oh, did I just get sick or something? I'm not sure what has happened to me, but apparently it's not as peaceful here as I thought it was. Easy. Sweet. Murder you, and murder you too, and then grab all the feathers that pop out of you like a bloody piñata. 
Any others? No, nope, that's fine. Okay, I just want to make as many arrows as I can so I'm not stuck without them when I need them. Look at this game, though. Look how gorgeous this game is. It's been out for a long time, too, so you kind of forget that it looks this good. When you ramp up all of the quality settings, which I can do now, because the last time I played this was a long time ago. Oh, it's the... It's the blue quaddies of deliciousness. All right, on game. Numb. Give me that. Have a cheeky snack on my way through. Probably don't want to eat the mushrooms I just found randomly on the ground. Like, I'm going on a trip, but not that kind of trip. That's a bit ambitious for my second day in this world. Some more mushies there, too. I assume, like, the small brown ones might be... <gasps> might be food. And then, like, the red spotty ones, the Mario ones, are bad for you. Stay there, dearie. Stay there. That was a dog shit effort, dude. That barely had enough power in it to get past the tip of your schlong. That was woeful. That was woeful. Now you're scared off Bambi. There he is. They will try again. Stick your noggin up for me there, chief. Where are you? Just there. Just there. Aim up. Uh. I shot you, but you didn't die. Oh, now I feel bad. Now he's blooded up and running. Well, I can't leave you like that. I have to finish the job. Um, I was chasing bams through the forest here. Go, oh, go along with that one. Missed it again. But there's like a, a, a crate. There's some sort of, oh, there's a, I'm in a place I shouldn't be. Bambi was clever and tried to lead me to where the monsters are. I feel like that should have been a better shot than it was. That's fine. Oh, I hit you. That was an arrow to the neck, and he's just yeeted out of here. Oh, another Bambi. Lots of Bambies. Have I stumbled into a Disney cartoon or something? This is a bit more than I was anticipating, but if you're this close... Stab. Stab, murder, kill. Come here. You made a mistake. I want you. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. But I also feel... Well, I'm not hungry right now, but I'll be hungry later. This is me being a responsible adult and trying to prepare for later on. Oh, I'm carrying its head? At least give it a pat or something. Like, I know I wanted to give cute animals a cuddle. This is a bit much. Can I even climb the rope to my house or are my hands too slippery, covered in the blood of cute, adorable baby animals? I don't know. I don't know. Well, I've left... Great, I've left the severed deer head behind because clearly that wasn't important at all. Can I make like a box or something to store some things in? I need some storage. Is there, here we go, storage two, small cabinet, large cabinet. I just need a box. That's all I'm really after. Just something to put some things into and then cry myself to sleep. Look at all that meat I got out of that shit. I'm now stacked with flesh, which is not such a bad thing. But how do I turn... My, um, how do I, first of all, how do I get my deer head up to the top? Can I, like, throw it up there or something? No, I can just drop it on the ground. I can attack with it. Oh, this is getting too much. I'm not sure how to get my head up there. So I'm just going to leave you over here for the moment, I guess, and jump upstairs and cook up your innards. Man, this went from zero to a hundred real fast. I suppose it's kind of the same for, like, getting logs up there as well. I wanted to make myself that set of, uh, not drawers, those shelves up there, but I can't climb a rope with a deer head. There's no way I can climb a rope with a log either. Huh. There must be a way to get things up there. I'm not sure how, but I'll figure that out later on. And it's getting real brisk yet. <gasps> Birdie boy! <gasps> that reminds me, actually. Just, just, just sit on my book for a second. I'm pretty sure I saw in here somewhere. Where was it? Where was it? Where was it? We have lots of skull decorations. We also have a birdhouse. A birdhouse. We can have... A <gasps> it can match my sweet treehouse. We can give him a little, a little sweet pad underneath mine. That's the perfect use of this log. Give me you... An entire log into that. There you go. There you go, buddy. Look, we're matching. We're the two best friends that anyone could have. How adorable. There's a campsite thing going on here with some more luggage from the plane. So someone's been up there salvaging right next to my house. Suddenly I'm rather antsy about where I've decided to live, but okay, fair enough. I can block. That's fine. Or... Or was this the luggage from the campsite that's just been kind of scattered around a little bit? 
Is there anything interesting for me here? I don't want a light. Ooh, some duct tape. That's always good. Some dollar dollary doos. That helps for cooking. I hear buzzards as well. Is oh a cooking pot? Thank you very much. Are there are there rem oh, Bambi, you scared the shit out of me. I know I murdered your friend a second ago. Doesn't mean you can't get to come and get revenge by giving me a mild heart attack. Oh, the scary noises. Bambi! Piss off! So these crates look different from regular luggage. Oh, they're like they're proper fancy boy arrows. Nice, 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 Gary. Take a couple of batteries as well, because my vibrator's out of- I mean, my appliances are out of them. What else is around? That's gonna be some more arrows there. I'll take them with me, but I can't, oh, I can't carry any more. Hang on, hang on, okay. How do I- How do I throw shit away? Because, like, the fancy pants arrows I want to save when I have a fancy pants bow. Wasting them on my regular, like, twig is not a great idea. I won't have to head back home- and drop off some of those arrows and come back for it. There's so much good gubs here. I'll be right back. Hang on. So I guess that's what I use the pot for. I would have assumed I can use it for cooking rather than just getting the maple syrup out of trees. Well, it does sound bloody delicious. Where was... I know I did see him. Explosives holder... Arrow basket. That's the one. That's the one. I'll quickly whack that upstairs so that I can... um. Like, no, not there, you pelican. Get upstairs and place it up there, because he can carry tw uh, sticks upstairs. So I'll put that down, store all my cool carbon arrows up here, then go and get the rest of them. My whole day started that we want to go murder a turtle. <laughs> I've been thoroughly distracted. It's getting just that little bit too dark for me to see what I'm really doing, so let's light our sweet improved stick, mind you. Not just a regular old stick, this stick is improved. Well, I mean, at least a little bit. It's got at least one piece of cloth wrapped around the top of it. God, this is even worse. Now my uh, my eyes aren't, like, trained for the darkness anymore. They're not acclimatized, so I can see even less than I could even with a lighter and a flame and stick in my hand. All right, fair enough then. But that should be enough now that it is night time for me to get up here. Can I finish off you? There you go. I don't know why my light went out there for a second, but I stack all those arrows in. Look at them. Look at them all. Is there a way I can just, like, I can say I just want to take the shitty arrows, not the good ones? Or are you just going to say that they're all, they're all, no, because look, that one's, do you differentiate between the arrows or just arrows and arrows and arrow and arrow? I, I, I don't know. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to stack all of them in them. Go and get the rest of them tomorrow. Where's my fire? Where's my fire and that has half a fucking deer cooked on it? Are you kidding me? Does like having the fire out in the elements means it gets broken and lost forever? That is not just mildly inconvenient, that's a kick right in the taint! Well, I wasn't happy about murdering Bambi yesterday, so I'm now going to be happy about murdering another one because all of my food's been stolen, but need to wait for that last slice of pizza pie to be filled up so that I can have a kip. I'm annoyed. I'm a little bit annoyed about that. It's a brand new day, and I need to set about doing all the things I did yesterday just again because all of my hard work came to nothing given what I had to deal with at the end then. I might even... I could just go like... Oh! Dude, I swung around and turned you into barely even a fillet. I'm right with that. Murder the bird behind me head with those sweet skills. I'll quickly cook up that because I need something to live on. Then I'll go to the baby camp, murder another baby deer, and hopefully this time swallow that guilt rather than bathe in it like I'm bathing in baby deer blood. And then set about eventually finding that bloody turtle. It was what I needed to do to start with. I still need to do it now. I might just put you all the way in here. If if it was the elements that broke you, I'll keep you nice and safe inside. Oh, look. No. No, birdie. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You can come back to your house. There was a birdie in his home. It's the blue one over there. I, don't, I need to come up. I need a name. I need a name for my new birdie pal. If he's going to be living just below me, we're going to be best friends. I'm going to need to know what to call him. 
Oh, okay. Well, next time I see him, I won't charge over there. Mittens are stretched, try to make friends with him. I'll just let him go about his business and hopefully he'll uh, come and perch on my hand again at some point. So yeah, who's got a good idea for a name for the bird? I'll put it out to the comments. Chuck in the comments down below. We'll see what people want to call him. But he's my friend. He's my friend, oh birdie pal. It's so good to see you, bud. I do like that there's like an actual notch at the back of the treehouse in the arch of the roof because that's how the Vikings had their chimneys. I'm going to have a fire in here. Need a place for the smoke to escape and... We'll just ignore the fact that there's an entire wall missing here, but you need it at the back too so the smoke doesn't get trapped. That's super good. Okay, I've now eaten a little bit, not much though, but should be enough for me to go and commit some mild animal murder. Um, there's my little birdie pal still floating about. Can I get like, I mean, I've got like seeds. Can I chuck some seeds in like a little dish for him just on the front of his little porch over here? If I'm going to have snacks, birdie boy needs snacks too. God, I need a name for him. There's some little fishies hanging out in this little pond here. So I'm going to quickly just grab those as well. I mean, any meat to meat to meat. I need to remember not to... Do I risk it? Do I risk it for the mushroom biscuit? Let's do it. Oh, yep. Okay, we're fine. We're all good. So as long as I remember not to murder my little birdie pal, then that's really all I need to worry about. Can I hit you, please? There we go. Do it. Where the shit did you come from? I was trying to murder a different fishy and got that one instead. How do I drop stuff? I've got so much random gubbins on me that I just don't need anymore. Equip or combine? How do I drop? I'm just trying to make everything I can to try and free out some inventory. I've made some armor. Which is pretty bloody dope. I'll chuck them on my arms and keep myself nice and safe. Can I do the same with you? Combine you. What do I need for this one? Oh, I need another deer skin, which I'll get in a second. When I find another Bambi and some rope to make a water skin. That's not too bad, actually. Or a warm suit. But we're going to get real snug as a bug in a deer skin rug. That's fine. Okay, I'll take the rest of these fishies now. Almost, still can't take all of them. All right, fair enough. Then I made myself a spear. I can keep one fish on that. I just, I can't just like drop shit out of here though. And it's really frustrating me. I just have so much random shit on me now. All right, I'm going to leave those fishies on the fire. Hopefully that's still here when I come back. I can finally, after all this time, set about heading out towards the ocean. I've been meaning to do it for a while now and keep... I'm not getting distracted, I suppose, but keep having to do some necessities to keep myself alive. There's no point in me traipsing about and running out into the coastline if I'm just going to peat out and die by the time I get there. Where's the campsite? There it is. Grab those arrows on the way through as well. Keep an eye out for a cheeky baby baby. Mm, not looking like much. Now I know I need one more baby skin, though. Now I know I need it. There'll be none to find. There was 18,000 deer yesterday. Now zero. Oh, I didn't even realize that that's a body. There are a couple of bodies here. Okay, well, I'm going to pretend like I didn't see that and just rob them blind instead. Thanks for all the dosh. Ooh. And some dynamites as well. Well, there is that weird node up there that's asking for a stick of dynamite. So now I have some. May as well do that. There are those um, arrows that I wanted. Any other sweet orange containers? That's one. More arrows out of you. I don't have a... Oh, I thought that was a tripwire then for a second. I just walked through a trap. I don't have a very good bow, but at least got the arrows to go into it. I think I've opened up all of the sweet orange chests, so I'll carry on my adventure. Get my sweet block and stick back out again in case I get into any sort of strife. Is there like... I keep hearing... You know before when I said everyone keep very, very quiet because I'm hunting rabbit? Everyone keep very, very quiet because now I'm being hunted. Oh, and there's like effigies around as well. I may have chosen a bad direction to go in. I'm going to go this way because I am a brave boy and I'm bravely running away like freaking Sir Robin. There's a Bambi. But as we know, archery does dick all. So I'm going to try and just sneak up on it and just... Take, I thought it was pieces of limb there for a second. And just take to it with an axe instead. Who needs stealth when you have sheer gusto? Although I have, by the looks of it, made it to the coast. There we go. I don't, I don't care if I have to murder a Bambi or a turtle or both. I don't really mind either way. But I need both of you to come with me. Come on, where are you going? 
Where are you going? You can head out to the bluffs all you want. Blow play poker. I know to call that bluff. Oh, and just massacre you instead. I'll oh, put it in the shop. It's just standing there and copping it. You could at least try and survive. Or is this your tactic? Make me feel so bad that I let you go. I'm sorry, bud. I'm sorry. I gave you a pat, but with an axe. Oh, I just need your skin. Oh, God. They're, they're still over there. They're on patrol. They found me. They knew I was heading to the bluffs. They tried to head me off. Oh, you cheeky sausages. All right. Well, you can have that then. I was just coming to invest... Oh, there's a lot of them up there. I was just coming to investigate this thing. What are you Muppets doing over there, by the way? Well, while you're distracted... Oh, there's a big boy holding a club over there too. While you're doing that, I'm just going to sneak on in and not grab a cooking pot, apparently, because I'm chock-a-bloody block. Nothing else here. Okay, that's fine. I'm just going to go the other way now. It's getting ominous. The thing I was going to say before is I keep hearing, like, the sounds of roars in the, in the jungle. Or in the forest, rather. Probably call it the forest, given it's what the game's called. I wonder what that is, too. That looks interesting. But I keep hearing, like, a roar that's actually just the wind through the trees. But it makes me worried there might be, like, a tiger or something coming up behind me. Oh, there's more effigies around. God, I just... I want a gun. Can I just murder these clowns? I just want to feel like I'm okay. I'm a little thirsty, but I know better than to try and drink the seawater. In fact, if I'm chock a block, how am I going to get a turtle shell home? I'll equip that. Can I throw you? No, that didn't throw it, did it? How do I... I think I just have to give up. I just have to give up on the idea of throwing things on the ground because apparently that's too much of an ask. I wanted to make another spear. All right, never mind then. Any turtles. I came out to the sandbar to find a turtle, but I'm not having much luck. Where are they going to be? Where are they all? There you are. There's the turtles, the hapless, helpless turtles. All right, everyone, just look away for a second while I quickly massacre my little friend here. Oh, sorry, Crush. I know you're on the East Australian current, but I just need you to not, not be anymore. You're now on the on the spirit current instead. So I can't take most... Oh, look! <laughs> Why are you holding the decapitated turtle's head like it's some weird necrotic fleshlight? Close its mouth, throw it away. You don't need it, all right? Oh, God, did you respawn? Jesus, you're keen crawling through the remains of your friend. You can't use that as a flashlight either. You sick fuck. <coughs> now that I have both those deer skins, actually, I needed a whole bunch of you. Chuck you in there. That's going to give me the water skin. Remove that. Does that mean I can now pick up that steak? No, still can't. What's the... Can't carry any more meat. So it's just the fact that I have a full pocket of meat at the moment. All right, that's probably fair enough then. I do have a shell, so that's all fine. I'll leave the rest of you to <laughs> take the head back and tell the tale of what happened to your turtly friend at the Turtle Club. All right, I need to get back home, but hopefully all those mups on the mountain over there are a long way away by now. I'm suddenly very anxious. Oh, oh God. Oh God, nope. Nope, 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 nope. I saw, like, the, the hull of the ship over there, that little boat. Oh, fuck me, Dad. You piss right the dick off, you hobbling Jeffrey. Nah. Fucking nah, mate. I'm not brave at the best of times, but when I'm armed with nothing but a stick, a little bit of fabric, and some gusto, I'm gonna run away. Because I have no gusto, I have nothing to fight with. I'm just gonna piss right... Oh, it's me breathing. My own breathing scared me half to death. God damn, I'm a wuss. But thank God I'm home. So my fire's still there. It is now just like, I don't know, some ashes on the ground. I can still eat the fish though. It's probably a little bit, a little bit janky now. A little bit air you going, but that's all right. We'll just get it in here because I can't pick it up, which is really annoying me. So maybe, maybe there's a better way. Can I make myself... What's the go? Food. Water collector. I now have one of those. I can chuck that downstairs. A drying rack. That's what I need. Do I chuck that up the top here? I mean, it's probably handy, as I said before, having snacks within arm's reach of your bed. Plus, I don't want to leave it down the bottom now that I know that there's Muppets cruising around causing issues. I'll just find a good way to stick down, would you please? 
Any, any way is a good way as long as you're stuck to the floor. Come on. That'll work. I got my turtle shell water bottle just now my nightstand. That's fine. And my snacks as well. I know I can just go down to the water down below to have a drink. That's where I'm going now. But if I wake up in the morning and I'm a little bit dry mouth, a little bit cotton mouth, a little bit parched, I can just dunk my head into the innards of a turtle instead of running all the way down the cliff over here. Run over here. I don't know what these things are for. I think you can climb. Like, it's got the rope on the side there. I think you can climb them, but I'm not sure what use they have for me, other than making me feel uncomfortable that the natives know where I am. There we go. Got my meat out and about, drying away. That'll be good. Got my turtle shell topsy-turvy and ready to guzzle up all the fluids from the sky. What else am I missing? I need to build, like, those uh, shells down there, so I need some logs, but... For the most part, though, this seems to be going relatively okay. I'll relight you, just because I like having some sort of light source in my house. Stack all the rest of my arrows into you. That was a good little adventure. I still want to go and throw that dynamite at the plug over there and see what's underneath it. I assume that's the thing. Like, it's a, a rock plug I can break open. There's maybe, like, a cave or something underneath, but I don't want to rush that. If I'm scared of a couple of Muppets shambling down a beach on their lovely coastal holiday, there's no way I'm ready to go adventuring into a cave when I get scared at dusk. The sun set very quickly, but this should be the last log that I need. Chuck one into there for future me to use. There we go. Last log into you. Nice. Now, can I actually use you for stuff? I can store medicine. Fair enough. I can store... A chocolate bar. All right, cool. Bananas. What about on the bottom shelf? D just, just nothing. Can't use the bottom shelf apparently. It's that's for I don't know. I guess cans of soda, and that's about it. So that's essentially just a grocery shelf. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Good night, birdie boy. Whatever your name's gonna be, we'll find out later, I suppose. Up we go. Back to my house. Gotta get dark quick. I hate that it gets so dark so quick, and I still can't sleep. I'll quickly save my game dome. That's been a successful journey, though. We finally got the turtle shell that I was after for so long. And also, mildly scared ourselves to death. But, now that I can finally sleep, I am going to take this opportunity to leave this episode here. Being back in the forest is great, and I miss playing it. But now that I'm back in it, I'm remembering how terrified I am of everything that's happening in this game. And I do remember... A whole lot of worse things waiting for me when I started adventuring into the caves. But it's like, to get better gear, you have to go adventuring. And to go adventuring means you find nightmares. Arts and nightmares down in the deep, dark depths. But I'll have to come back and continue into those nightmares in another episode because this episode is done so thank you guys for watching most of all thank you to the page the patreon who made this episode possible if you like make sure you hit the like button down below or subscribe to this channel follow me on twitter if i don't talk to you there first i'll see you in the next episode have a good one